Welcome to Sakai at UNC. In this video, I want to identify your options for grading and also compare the two main tools for grading. When it comes to recording grades as the instructor, you have two options. You can use the gradebook tool, which is basically an out-of-the-box approach to tracking and calculating student grades. It's very similar to Blackboard's Grade Center. And your other option is to use the POSUM tool, which is a manual approach to recording and calculating students' grades. Now, to really determine which tool is best for you, you're going to have to ask yourself a few questions. Do you want a low maintenance approach to grading, one that automatically integrates with other tools in Sakai, such as assignments and tests and quizzes? A tool that allows categorizing and weighing grades, but not other functions, such as dropping the lowest grade or allowing extra credit? then Sakai's gradebook is most likely a better choice. Or, if you are more hands-on and need to apply more advanced functions in your grading, such as dropping the lowest grade, maybe you have a grade scale that's different from UNC's, or want to add custom notations like attendance, then Sakai's POSTUM tool is most likely a better choice for tracking grades. Now keep in mind that either approach will allow you to maintain a record of your grades in an Excel spreadsheet or CSV file. If you do not have the gradebook tool or POSTUM tool enabled, then you can go to Site Info, Edit Tools, and check the box for either the gradebook or POSTUM tool, and scroll down, click on Continue, and Finish. Now you'll see those, those tools located in the course sites navigation on the left column. Both the POSTUM and the gradebook will only allow a student to view his or her grades if you choose. And as always, if you're curious what a student will see when visiting a page in Sakai, you can choose to view that page as a student. Now if you do that, don't forget to exit the view as student option. Remember. The POSTUM tool is a way for you to calculate your grades offline using a program such as Excel. After updating students' grades, you need to save the document as a CSV file in order to properly upload back into Sakai's POSTUM. The basic instructions for this process are on, in the uh, POSTUM tools page after you click on add. A quick tip. No matter which tool you choose, I would recommend that you use the gradebook tool to set up your grade entries. After you set up your grade entries, you can download a spreadsheet that is already formatted and populated with your students' names, their usernames, and the columns are identified with the assignments already. It's just easier to fill in the proper information and any other notations that you track before saving it as a CSV file and uploading it back into Sakai. So the gradebook tool gives you that pre-formatted spreadsheet. Makes it simple. Now the gradebook tool allows some more uh, some variation and since it is integrated with other tools it's generally maintained online while you are logged into Sakai. Instructors can view information in the gradebook in different ways. You can view all the grades at once, view the grades by entries or assignments. You can view it by student or view it by section. St remember, students can view their scores in the gradebook if you choose to release the item to students. And it's the same as in the POSTUM. So just because you have grades in that particular tool, it doesn't mean students will see it. You have to actually check a box to allow students to see their grades. Another difference between the POSTUM and the gradebook tool is that the gradebook is section aware. So teaching assistants can see grades only for students in their particular sections, whereas the instructor will see all the sections and all the grades for each student collectively. So for grading, the key concepts are you know, both tools let you choose whether or not students will be able to view their grades and also hide other students' grades from their view. So at any given point, once students logged in, they will only be able to see their grades. 
The Postum tool is actually a bit more flexible in setting up and customizing grades. But remember, the Postum tool is designed only for posting grades, not for calculating grades. The gradebook will calculate grades. And the gradebook tool is integrated with other tools, which is another difference between the two. The gradebook tool is section aware. Like I was explaining earlier, the instructors will see all the grades. TAs will only see the grades associated with their section. And for more information, please refer to the Sakai blog found at blog.sakai.unc.edu for how-to tips, videos, and the latest news about Sakai at UNC.